John Fitchett here, and this here is a test of our uh, webinar platform for preparation for PLC training webinar. And first, I want to show you our rig we've got here in the class. So switch over. And uh, at the time that I'll be showing you the program, I can also show you the I.O. up here. So, for example, here. We're moving data into an internal word, which is cross-referenced to real-world output. So every time you see six bits turn on here, you'll see the six LEDs out in the real world turn on too. And we also have a classroom show and tell rig right here. So this is the PLC that you're seeing the I.O. for. And then we've also got a MicroLogix, another Slick 500 and a control logics, which is a process automation controller, a PAC. Then on to the test uh, slide that we're going to use here. And so millions are lost every year from people getting the terms upload and download, switched around, transposed, mixed up. And so it's very important that anytime you go to click an upload or download button inside the PLC software, RS Logix 500, you need to stop and think about it. Make sure you've got it correct. Do you want to upload or do you want to download? A good way to remember that is with this visualization that if you visualize that the laptop is on top because it's more technologically advanced, than a, a PLC, then anytime you want to take a copy of the PLC program and put it on your laptop or computer, you would choose upload. And vice versa, when you uh, have a copy on your program and you want to put it inside the PLC, you would download to the PLC. This analogy also works with the internet which you're probably already familiar with when you want to take something from your computer or laptop and put it up on the internet, which is more technologically advanced, you would use upload. The reason we say it's more technologically advanced is theoretically, if you have one or more people or computers connected together, they're more powerful than any one individual or computer. So therefore it's higher on the technology tree and therefore when you're taking something from the internet, putting it on your computer, you're downloading it off the internet. Taking it, once again, taking it from your computer and putting it on the PLC, you're downloading it to the PLC. Also, be aware of the risk. This is a good time to bring that up. Uh, PLC, there's virtually no cybersecurity risk if it's not connected to a computer. Once you connect to a computer, a computer has medium cybersecurity risk. And so that increases it. And of course, if you connect your industrial system to the internet, you're at extreme risk. And remember, the cloud is the internet too. So you can have your PLC connected to your computer, your computer running a cloud app, it's connected to the PLC. You're at extreme risk for your industrial equipment, damage to man or machine. So anyway, that's one of the slides in our uh, online PLC training webinar, which is a three-day webinar. And let's hope all this rig works. So, And I'm back. So everybody have a good day. I hope this uh, test worked out fine for you. And see you during the webinar.